Hello, hi, how are you, and welcome to the new video, everyone. Um, this one's going to be a little bit of an odd one. It's going to be a collection of clips that I took over the last few days, mainly because I didn't really, I don't know, I just didn't do a good job planning ahead, you know, like I do, um, when it came to, you know, planning out videos, and I forgot to film a little bit, and whatever, but the first set of clips are going to be of some Christmas lights of an event called Light Up Middletown uh, that my brother and I went to a couple days ago um, that are some fun things. So I'll go ahead and I'll stop talking and I'll roll those right now. Brother just brought up a good point. Is it me or is the snowman smoking a cigarette? That's, uh, that's not a great message for the kids is it after about an hour and 20 minute waits waits just wait we're entering the park which is i believe called smith park in middletown ohio for a little event called light up middletown they do this every year this is the 20th year pretty fun Apologies for the water on the window, too. It's a little, little rainy outside, so you might see a flash of the windshield wipers every now and then, kind of like that. But uh, my brother and I actually came and did this last year, too, so I'll leave a link to that video down below. But still should be a good amount of fun. And for those of you that are interested, I believe you can meet Santa. Right over there. Right next to this reindeer fishing. Ooh, that's a good bite. Here's a fun one for you. There's a jack in the box springing up right next to some other old classic toys. And is that a little bit of a Pixar reference? Kind of looks like the Luxo ball famous from Toy Story. Here's another classic you might recognize. All you have to do is follow the yellow brick road. But we're definitely not in Kansas anymore. As illustrated by these penguins that are also fishing. Fishing seems to be a theme of the lights this year. Maybe just those two displays, but still pretty fun. I've said that a lot this time. This small bear is a lot like how I would be ice skating. Took a little bit of a tumble. This year, the reindeer are riding on whales to deliver presents. Not sure where Santa is, but that's, that's what's going on. Santa's workshop is straight ahead, but have to be careful. The Grinch has been sighted in the area and he's stealing presents. It's pretty neat how they, they do that. Santa has a new way of getting around this year. He's taking a boat, the SS Santa. As we go into this array of lights. I think we know what Santa has in mind for his vacation when he's done delivering all the presents on uh, Christmas. Now you can see the physical representation of all the things that you got on the, the day, 12 days of Christmas. So on the first day, you get a partridge in a pear tree. It's flapping about. And the rest are still to come. And for five golden rings, Santa's playing ring toss with Rudolph is just using him as a prop to catch his rings. Is that animal abuse? Who knows? And here's a good one for you, Dad. Soccer uh, Santa is kicking the ball. It's up. Will he make it? No, looks like the goalie saved it. And on the way out, a snowman 
waving goodbye as we go back into the tunnel of colorful lights. We waited in the line for that for about an hour and 20 minutes. Um, so I was a little tired, if you couldn't tell, when all of that started filming. It was fun though, It was I really enjoyed that. It's a free event, I don't think I said that. It's every day up until New Year's maybe? Christmas, one of the two, in that range of week. Uh, but it's only from six to 10. Uh, I'll leave the website down below if I can find it or Facebook page, but yeah, the next uh, set of clips, I actually went to the Dayton Flyers basketball game uh, versus Drake on the 12th, so or not the 12th, the 14th, so yesterday. And again, I meant to film some things from that, but I forgot because it was the first time I had seen my friends Nick and SK in what to me felt like a fairly long time. It was around Thanksgiving because we hang out a lot um, than most, you know, most people, I feel like at least, uh, hang out, but... So yeah, I, I forgot to film some things, but I did film a few things, and I am going to put those in for your enjoyment right now. You like your nachos? They're all right. They're gone. Now we wait. And then after the game, we met up with some of uh, our friends that I hadn't, again, hadn't seen in a good amount of time at uh, one of our favorite breweries in Dayton called Warped Wing, uh, which I haven't been to in like a year. Um, and you can see a little clip I took of that right here. It's not that long, but this. And then that was the rest of uh, our my night and weekend, pretty much, because today is Sunday. I'm filming this right before I edit it, um, and that was that. Uh, so, yeah, I I uh, I've been working a lot on like going to the gym and whatnot. So I I tend to I keep forgetting not about the channel and you guys. I just I don't plan well in terms of what I'm going to do and where I'm going. And I've had a lot of Saturdays I've actually had to work. Um, which if you know, I usually go out and try to film something on Saturday, but I am, and I've said this like 7,000 times at this point, but I'm going to try to get so much better at like going out somewhere at like late at night. I know it's just, it's, it gets dark at like four now. So like, and I get off work most days at four thirty. So like, it's just hard to go and do something and film something when it's dark out. Um, especially because there's not, there's not a ton to do in Dayton, um, that you can do during the week because most things close at like five that were, are like events or like things, you know, like places that I can go and show you guys. So it's a lot harder for me to go and do that during the week, but I'm going to try harder to try to make more content uh, for this channel because it's a lot of fun and I enjoy doing it and I hope you enjoy watching it But with that being said, I've done enough rambling for this video If you liked what you guys saw give it a thumbs up if you're not already subscribed uh, Subscribe hit the button down below that would help a lot uh, ring the bell You'll get all notifications for when I post if you're new around here uh, Keeps you in the loop uh, all the new videos that come out um, but until next time guys, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.